Hello, viewers. Welcome to the World of Wonders. Here are the most fascinating animals in Qatar that you have never seen. Before going into the video, please subscribe to our channel. Horn Viper Oh, we got some really nice views today. Are you going? People who are afraid of snakes find them scary enough without any bonus. Real demonic creatures. Cold, resilient, hissing geese. Now imagine what happens when you add a horn to this set. A horned snake. This snake lives throughout North Africa and the Arabian Peninsula, except Morocco. Horn vipers prefer deserts and semi-deserts. Because of their color, they hide in the sand and can get close to prey. Except that the smell of sulfur puts them off a bit. Well, well, we've never actually smelled horn vipers. And to be honest with you, we don't recommend it. They are predators that like to lie in wait until their prey is close. The horned vipers then strike at lightning speed. Usually it is designed for rodents, birds, or lizards. But a person is unlikely to be stung by venomous fangs. Swelling, bleeding, nausea, vomiting, necrosis, the whole range of consequences. In fact, scientists don't even know why it's needed. Some say it's protection against other predators. The horned head has an unusual shape, and hence the snake is difficult to spot. Oryx. It is a small and proud antelope. It is a national animal of Qatar. The oryx, with a straight horn on top of its nose and a triangular beauty spot, has come a long way since its extinction and reintroduction to the wild in the 1980s. Falcon. Falcons are famous for novelty and wealth in Qatar. There are six different types of falcons in Qatar, including the Great Falcon, the Soda Falcon, the Ladder Falcon, the Seer Falcon, the Pergola Falcon, and the Barbary Falcon. The falcon is used as a hunting tool due to its keen eyesight. Desert Hedgehog Being a desert hedgehog, it's a little hard to survive, means they adapt eating habits to what is available in the desert. Spiny-tailed Agama Here are some interesting facts about it. As it heats up or cools down, it changes color. When it is cold, it becomes dark gray. And when it is warm, it changes to light yellow or sand color. It defends itself by waving its muscular spiny tail and waving at its predators. It is strictly vegetarian. Jewel Beetles the jewel beetle is like no other beetle. This beetle is as beautiful as its name, with its diamond-shaped wings and feeds exclusively on the nectar of three flowers. Pharaoh Eagle The Pharaoh Eagle got its name because it was actually found nesting on one of the pyramids of Egypt, and hence it is called Pharaoh Eagle. But the royal bird which will spend its winter in Qatar builds nests on the ground and rocks. A rockfish is monogamous for life, but parents will nurse the young. Dugong Dugong is a large mammal with a gaping snout. In this episode of World's Strangest Animals, we bring you the dugong. The dugong is also known as sea cow. It is a large marine mammal, one of the four living species of the order Serena. The other three genera, measuring up to 11 feet or 34 meters in length, and weigh 2,000 pounds or one ton. The dugong, while having a flat tail like flippers and whales, is more closely to the elephant. It is believed that the elephant-like creature entered the water and eventually evolved into the dugong. The dugong is more agile than you think. The mammal can perform a neat maneuver. When in shallow waters, it can stand on its tail and turn its head above the surface of the water. They can live in both groups or on their own. When they grouped with others, they will use unique sounds to communicate. This noise comes in the form of screams, chirps, and barks. Their large, heavy bones keep them submerged underwater while their lungs on their backs keep them in horizontal alignment, perfect for swimming. Their swimming speed is slow, about 6 miles or 10 normal paces. Although they are able to achieve maximum speed at about 14 miles or 22.5 kilometers per hour, the dugong reaches sexual maturity between 9 to 15 years of age. 
females get pregnant for a full year, which happens every three to seven years. A strong bond is formed between mother and cub, which lasts up to 18 months before the calf is left on its own, provided there is an adequate supply of food. Due to the sand that comes from their grassy lunch, dugons shake their heads from side to side, releasing most of the sand from the grass before consumption. Many of them live off the coast of the UAE. Dubai is known for its man-made islands, which yearn for a large ship pumping tons of sand into one place. All this coastal development is killing the seagrass, which is vital to the dugong's survival. This marine mammal requires an abundance of this low-nutrition seagrass to sustain itself. But it's not just coastal development that threatens them. Marine chemical pollution, collisions with boats, and entanglement in fishing nets are also responsible. Abu Dhabi has stepped up to create a protected area where all dugongs hang out that is free from tourism, development, and fishing. Now protected by law, dugong numbers have to recover. Human threat isn't the only thing that they need to worry about, as killer whales, crocodiles, and sharks all enjoy dugongs as food. Currently, the largest dugong population is in the Red Sea, followed by an endangered population off the coast of Abu Dhabi. What do you think humanity can do to help the dugong species survive and ultimately thrive? Let us know in the comments below. RuPaul's Fox there are different kinds of fox. Actually, Rupal's fox is rare in Qatar. This fox loves to live in deserts and eat everything to survive. They spend their full day in caves and appear in the nighttime. Their ears are bigger than their heads, which increases their beauty. Another interesting fact is that they sound like dogs. Their size is not bigger than a wild dog. Before ending the video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more interesting videos like this. Thanks for watching.